So I have a couple of projects coming up that are going to need a 0 0.1 ohm resistor. That's one tenth of an ohm. And uh, I don't have an appropriate one tenth of an ohm resistor. Mine are a little bit too small. And the reason they're too small is because I may be drawing up to 20 amps through this circuit. Um, one thing I do have is I do have some nichrome wire here. And uh, I'm going to take and use this wire and use Ohm's Law and uh, figure out how much, much one tenth of an ohm of this is. And here's how we're going to basically do that. Uh, we got Ohm's Law and we're looking for a desired resistor of uh, 0 0.1 ohms. We're going to put 1 amp, 1 1.0 amps through this piece of wire from here to here. You can see where the clips are. And uh, what sort of voltage do we need to find? What sort of voltage across that uh, resistance? is the appropriate amount of voltage to tell us that it's 0.1 ohm. And of course that's uh, current times the resistance, the current being one, the desired resistance being 0 0.1. That gives us 0.1 of a volt. So we're gonna probe this wire with the multimeter, with the voltage meter. We know we've got one amp coming through here and we're gonna be looking on here for 0.1 of a volt and that will equate to 0.1 of an ohm. So we have our supply here and we're a little bit off from one amp. So the power supply is quite finicky to adjust for that. So it's just a lot easier for me to slide this back and forth. And we're going to move this down a little bit here, throw a bit more resistance effectively into the circuit. And uh, that's, that's pretty close. So we're going to call that good. That's an amp. And our voltage that we're going to be watching for on this guy here is 0.1 of a, a volt. And we're going from this end here. So we're gonna be measuring from here. We're gonna be looking for 0.1 of a volt here. And when we find that, we are gonna take and measure it to 0.1, right about, right about there. And that's going to be our mark. And uh, you may not be able to see this on the, on the camera, but the mark is on there. And I'm going to take and cut this just past this mark because I want to loop that a little bit to put it underneath this screw. So the screw is going to, on the clip, is going to sit right here. The other clip is already on here. And uh, that should give us 0.1 of an ohm between these two spots. So I've taken and added the alligator clip here, uh, wrapped the piece of wire around underneath this screw, and we've got our one amp going through the whole thing here again, and I'm going to take and measure the voltage across this, and there we go, our 0 0.102, close enough for me, close enough for what I need it for, and if you just should decide to make something like this, and you've got bare wire like that, you could always use a piece of... Uh, heat shrink and just put it over that. This is only for a couple of projects and then I'm probably going to recover these uh, clips. I'll probably take and throw that piece of wire. I'll label it as to 0.1 of an ohm and I'll, I'll put it in my uh, low value resistor drawer and uh, if I ever need it in the future it's sitting there all ready to go. If you need a low ohm resistor for say a measurement or something and uh, you, you don't have a tenth of an ohm or you don't have any nichrome don't despair because you can always just go and use a twist tie. This is a steel in the middle and uh, peel the plastic off the outside, put some current through it. Right now we're putting 1.05 amps through this thing from here to here. And right about this point is where it's one tenth of an ohm. And I know that because I'm getting 0 0.105 of a volt right here. This is uh, screwed down to it. So there's a tenth of an ohm from there to there. So do your measurement, put this in the circuit, whatever. Obviously you can't run, you know, 20 amps through this thing, at least not for very long. And, uh, you know, get your measurement and then take the screws off and throw that in the garbage or whatever. Just reuse it for whatever you need it for and good to go. Just uh, get creative with a lot of things that you have around. Steel uh, has a fair bit of resistance to it, so um, you might find something that works for you.